where is the energy shifting in coming 48 hours let's check it doesn't really mean that this is going to happen in coming 48 hours this is where the energy is shifting all right it's a collective reading take what resonates leave what doesn't um be aware of the scammers scammers are extraordinary these days so if you want to book a paid private reading with with me only option to email me at divine mother's guidance at gmail.com don't misspell this because scammers has made fake email id with wrong spelling so make sure that you are watching on the screen that is written there that is my correct email id if you are watching me on tiktok divine mother's guidance with a guidance with a a and now if you are watching me in instagram Oh, sorry in tiktok um, it should be on the screen but if you're watching me on youtube it should be in the description box that's the only email id there's no other alternative i have only one youtube channel let's us tarot and my um what do you call it only tiktok account is divine mother's guidance with 151k plus followers i will never follow you offer you a dm reading i have no time for that shit anybody doing that that's scammers after that if you're scam you're scam i will never give you my whatsapp number be careful with that okay so let's get ch let's check what is coming in coming 48 hours for you so the first card come up is someone else someone else is the middle someone is trying to sabotage this so it looks like it's a romantic connection there is a third party situation so if you are in a romantic situation where the connection broke due to the third party situation this can be a confirmation that this is your reading so what is happening in the third party situation or this situation water sign cancer scorpio pisces so you might be a water sign your person might be water sign or maybe air sign so um uh, gemini libra aquarius cancer scorpio pisces can be significant don't worry about the signs too much this is just a it can be fucking fire sign came up also Aries, leo aquarius everybody everybody's here only the art sign is left but doesn't matter uh what is that no it's not the time it's not the right time right time for what right time for what clarify no narcissist someone too full of themselves okay you might be dealing with somebody here where it can be a third party situation this person might be very self-obsessed very selfish maybe just uh you know gaslighting you manipulating you very toxic person that you are dealing with you might be dealing with a toxic connection moving okay one thing i want to tell you be aware of narcissistic personality disorder 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 if you are dealing with someone who is very on and off very abusive do gaslighting manipulation you need to make sure that you are aware of that the characteristics of narcissist if you are dealing with a narcissist no read no love reading is for you you should go to a therapist and heal yourself they are mentally uh, people you cannot deal with them all right today tomorrow they will destroy your life honey no love reading for narcissistic okay communication uh, compromise forgive work it out some kind of communication is coming towards you moving uh, okay moving is this coming with the home so somebody may be moving on with it. listen what i'm finding here you it can be that this connection broke due to third party situation this person might be very toxic or the relationship might appear very toxic to you. So, yeah, sideline narcissistic thing you can make sure. Um, maybe this person is coming. If you are in no communication with this person, maybe this person will send you some communication towards you and moving towards you with a home who is like, you know, uh, moving towards something or it can be moving your home because obviously after not after the breakup, somebody is not moving with you. So this can be like somebody wants to move towards you. Okay, so what else? gambling yeah somebody might take a chance uh this person might be thinking like i don't know whether this person you are still waiting for them or not so they might take a leap of faith they might take a chance clarify no okay they will be back clarify no patience okay but what is this no all about honeymoon liar it's not the right time okay it can be like this connection was a very short-lived connection or maybe you go through very short-lived romance period like a honeymoon some period is very good some period again bad so this can be a very toxic relationship it can be on and off on and off on and off toxic relationship that's why it is probably saying about narcissistic um uh, this person will take some chance again will they might have lied to you they might have lied to you about the third party or some kind of lie um, deception in this connection now what i'm sensing they will be back they will come back to you some kind of communication will come but this is not the right time 
this person probably thinking about this communication in coming 48 hours period of time they're probably thinking about this connection they're probably thinking about i will communicate with them i will do this i'll do that da, 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 da. but at the end of the day might not be right time in coming 48 hours so the energy is shifting in this way so you might see it later on it might let me see what else two more cards let go make room for new beginnings on the way for you so that some transformation is happening so i think make new for a new beginning it's here that butterflies are transformation right so you might be seeing butterflies that can be a sign so what it is saying let go whatever you are holding on okay maybe this person is not that toxic maybe this whatever you perceive the worst version of this person is not correct so probably this is a time to reflect what exactly going on on it this of toxicity can be from your side also maybe you are acting like a little bit of toxic nobody wants to hear that but i'm gonna say it anyways because <laughs> so maybe the time is for you to sit down with this in like you know whatever happened in connection and analyze that what you did or what this person did is this if this person is toxic you need to let them go if you know that this person is a narcissist this person is toxic this relationship is not good for me they are liar they're with somebody else this is you need to go but yes if this is a situation that some kind of your perceived truth about this person is not correct maybe this is a time when sit down and uh, analyze what you have been thought thinking about this person and whether you really want them to come back to your life if you really want in that case you need to let go the anger and the resentment that you are holding on but yes in coming 48 hours energy definitely this person thinking of coming back to you that's for sure but again i'm telling you this is only about the connection uh, energy so it don't have to be that this person is going to come back to you in coming 48 hours this is about their thought process where the energy is shifting but you know what you did is good at giving you lectures so what are you going to do nothing nothing about it keep doing your fucking life okay keep doing your fucking life focus on your life your career your money your physical and mental well-being this is your daily reminder okay whoever comes whoever goes this kind of shit will happen in life okay but you came to live your life on this fucking earth live it at the fullest every day counts every day counts life is a very short period it's it's not forever thing so enjoy every moment today this person is not with you that's okay there are many other blessings in your way enjoy that blessing that you can at this moment other will have uh, whatever it will happen whatever is supposed to happen it will happen whatever is not supposed to happen it is not going to happen enjoy this moment at the fullest take care bye